know. Because we know through scriptures the weapons of our warfare are not carnal, but they are mighty and they are putting out of strongholds. You know, our weapon is, is the word of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah. You know, this truth that, that, that is spreading forth throughout the earth. That's, that's our weapon. Our weapon, we, we're fighting spiritual warfare. You know, we're fighting spiritual battle. Because every day we, every day that we're waking up, you know, about how we get how about shit, we have shot. So we have to fight, we, we fight a spiritual warfare. You know, uh, the battle is in our mind. You know, we, we cast down every, uh, you know, scripture said, cast down every imagination and everything that exalts itself against the knowledge of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah. You know, we cast down, we cast, we gotta cast down the imagination. You know, we got to come out in carnal state of mind. You know, you can't, you know, you can't go, to, go out there on the highways and byways and, and you know, and, and turn, you know, going out there to, to wake up the whole full day and, and turn away ears go back to y'all by shimmy out shop. And, and you out there, you know, you got guns and stuff on you. And you go, you go to the video that you at the uh, target range. You know, you at the gun range, you know, practicing, you know, shooting targets. You know, that's not a good look for Israel. You know, we, you know, we, that that's bringing uh, that's bringing the truth into a negative light. You know, and yeah, boy, you know, especially you saw they they gonna they gonna lump all that together. Say they gonna like see all the Israelites like that. You know, they're a hate group. They already think they already think that we're a hate group anyway. Not, not, and they already think they were terrorists. Now they gonna really, really gonna put a spot upon uh, the Hebrew Israelite and say, "See, I told you. So look at them brothers with the guns. Look at them Hebrew Israelite with the guns. You know, look at them at the target range wearing on fringes. You know, that that puts a negative light upon the truth." Uh, Proverbs 18, 19 said, "A brother, you know." Brother is angry, you know, it's harder to win. You know, it's like a, a, a city with a wall. You know, something to that effect. You know, we, here we are, out here, you know, on YouTube, doing YouTube lessons, on the highways and byways teaching to the spirit of your house, by Shim, your house shop. Out here to, to wake up the whole for that. And, and now, you know, now, now that, that puts a black eye on, you know, we know the whole for left gonna wake up anyway, but that really puts a black eye on, on, uh, you know, on, 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 on the uh, Hebrew is like, that really puts us up really in a negative light. Because uh, now, we got now, you know, the brothers have to, you know, book, make lessons and, and not only for the edification purpose, but also, because uh, you got these brothers from bring guns out here, man. Bring guns to the, uh, 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 you know, bring guns out there on the street corner, man. You know, you know, just what I said, you know, I'm going to be getting a weapon of our warfare on our heart. You know, you're not going to, you know, you're not going to win a spiritual battle with carnal means. I mean, that you're not going to be Esau in his own game, in his own weapon. That's why scripture also tells us to wait on Yahweh. You know, that he's going to rise up to the prey. You know, we wait on Yahweh by Shimmy House Shop. You know, we're not, you know, we're not to go out there and, and take back to our own man. We're not to go out there and think that, that uh, we're we supposed to go out there and, and think that we're going to be Esau with his weaponry. You know, you got to be kidding me. You're not going to be Esau. With weapon. He, he make a weapon now that he ain't even fit to be got to be there. He's going he to say, you know, a drone in our neighborhood and blow up our neighborhood. You know what I'm saying? We, you know what I'm saying? We don't have the spirit, we don't have the power, the automation to even beat this devil. You know, we got the way on, we got, we depend on your, the power you have by Jimmy House Shot to deliver us. We have, we have faith that the power of Yahweh by Shimmy Hasha is going to rob uh, us salvation, going to rob us victory. You know, and 
know, you don't go out there and, and try to use a uh, uh, carnal warfare to fight, fight a spiritual battle. You're going to lose. Plain and simple. You got to fight this battle on the spiritual warfare, though. You got to fight in the spirit. You got to fight in the You cannot win a spiritual battle. those who've been in the truth for a long for, for a long period of time. You cannot win a spiritual battle with carnal means. Meaning that meaning that you should not allow yourself to stoop to a carnal level to try to fight a spiritual battle. And the, and the brothers and actually the brothers going off. You know, you, you know, you don't supposed to carry weapons after, and you know, out there when you, when you uh, out there on the highways and byways, bringing out the word. You know, you, you know, you, you, trust, you trust and depend on your house box, Jimmy house shot, to take care of you. Because you doing his will, or you doing his work. So you trust in your how about you got to be that he won't take care of you. Hey, you know, if something happens to you, hey, it's the will of your how about shit be how shot. That he allowed it to happen to you. You know, that you know, you know that's that, you know, that's nothing you can do about it because it's, it's the will of your how about shit be how shot. And you know, don't you know, don't be carnal minded out there on the highways and byways uh, you out there making you know you are you uh doing a YouTube lesson uh, yeah. you know when you edify the body of your high body shimmy outside especially you you start to wake up the whole for that you don't you know you don't use carnal means to try to uh bring out a spirit spiritual point are you are you trying to uh, uh fight a spiritual battle with carnal means you, you know you're not gonna win. The fight is a spiritual fight, not a carnal fight. You know, you got to rely on your how by shim your how shot. You cannot fight a spiritual battle with carnal means. And I know I keep repeating it, but you know, I want your brothers out there, the argument, argument, and aquas out there, to understand this. You cannot fight a spiritual battle with carnal means. We got to rely on our power, which is Yahweh by Shimmy Howard Shah, to see us through. Because that's the only way that we're going to win if we rely on the power of Yahweh and Son Yahweh Shah. There's no other way we're going to win this battle. No other way. We got to have, we got to have hope, hope. If I have hope, if I have faith, that you have five shit, you have shot, it's gonna see us too. Now, the scripture said the race is not given to the swift nor to the strong, but those who do it to the end. Guess what? We got to do it to the end. We got to fight, fight this uh, spiritual battle to the end. You know, we can't quit on you have five shit, you have shot. You know, this is not the time to be carnal minded. that we allow to be calm to mind it because get what you see the prophecies un unfold right before your very eyes. You know, you see you see that we that your house shot is soon as they get the turn. And you see all the prophecies all the all the stuff that are taking place. This is no time for us bro for us brothers to be calm to mind it. And for you aqua on your sisters out there, there's no time to be carnal minded. You know, we're almost at the end. We're almost at the end of East Talk leadership. There's no time to be carnal mind. There's no time to go back into the world. I try to dip and dive into the world and think you're going to just get out of the time. No, 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 no. We're not carnal. 
they are, they are mighty and they are putting down a stronghold. Meaning that our weapon is a spiritual weapon, which is your house by shipping your house shot. Our weapon is our spiritual, which is his word. He gave us his word to study. Second Timothy 2.15 said to study to show thyself proof unto your house. And work me not need to be ashamed, rightly divine the word of truth. Meaning that mean that we we supposed to study his word. So even even if you got to go on on, on uh on, on YouTube listen to a brother lesson. You know, me personally I listen to the men of the I used to listen to Great Millstone. Now you got brother they they do some excellent breakdowns on, on they on they channel. You know I love you know to be quite honest I learned from them. You know, through spirit, y'all by shim, y'all shot. He's not be, he's not be saying, they don't break me to start. Bro, they break me up. You know, I watch they chum. I learn a lot from them. It's only through spirit, y'all by shim, y'all shot. You know, it, it's basically, it's a study. You get edification. You gotta get what we all have room for growth. We all have room for improvement. Even I myself, I'm no exception. I'm still learning just, just as well as anybody else. We get back to the point, you know, we, you know, we can't be carnal minded. You know, you, you know, you being carnal minded, you're going off, you know. Already hard enough, you know, to uh, win 
back our brothers and sisters back into the truth and get them to repent. Time and a 
different seasons for everything. Right now is not the time for us to be having guns out there or uh, out there when we out here teaching. That's, that's not the appropriate time or the season to do that. When you do that, you just made a bigger target upon upon the brother out there that out there teaching the truth. Uh, out there when they when they uh when they lie for freedom to bring the truth. Now all of a sudden now you uh now you all made a target for them. You don't put a bit of target on their back. Mighty and putting down a stronghold. 
being that our weapon, our weapons are spiritual. It was just the word of Yahweh Hashem Yahweh It's to bring out the truth, to wake up the hope for the so we can get the hell up out of here and we can ride with uh, Yahweh and Son Yahweh Shah. You know, being the hope for the land. You know, that's it for a lesson. All praise to the Most High, Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shah, Yahweh Hashem Rahakadash. Love on to the apostle, elders, and prophets who teach the words of clarity and truth unto the hopeful land and the confusion of faces, unto the aquawak that aquawak and bow this and another, until next time, Yahweh will, shallow one.